Hi guys, in this video we're going to talk about the fifth body type. What is the fifth body type? Well, you have the adrenal, which is high levels of cortisol, that's a stress hormone. You have the thyroid body type, which is low levels of thyroid hormone, T4 or T3. Okay, That gives an overall weight gain in the entire body. This one is more of a sagging belly. Then we have the ovary type, that's like a pear shape. It's heavier around the hips, the thighs, the lower butt. That is high levels of estrogen. Okay, then we have the liver, which is more of a protruding basketball belly. That is uh, liver damage, and then you're going to have low growth hormone, okay? And what's the fifth? <laughs> the pancreas, high insulin. That's insulin resistance, okay? Now, this is what's confusing. A lot of people are a mixed body type, and they have various symptoms, but there's a much easier way to figure out your primary body type, but more than that, the primary cause of your body type, okay? The trigger. For example, the body shape for the adrenal can look identical to the pancreas body shape, but because from two different things. This is stress triggered. Let's say you had surgery, you had trauma, you had an accident, you had a divorce, you had years of being in a very stressful situation, and then you got fat because of high cortisol, okay? That could be the trigger for your adrenal body type. Or, let's say you ate a lot of sugar or refined carbs and ate a lot of uh, frequent meals, that could also uh, give the same adrenal body type appearance. Sagging belly, weight in the midsection. So just by looking at the outside of the body, you can't really tell what's causing the problem. It could be stress-related, could be food-related. So let's take the liver body type. What could cause that? Fatty liver, cirrhosis, inflammation of the liver like hepatitis, which could come from a virus. This could come from being an alcoholic. But you can also have non-alcoholic fatty liver disease, which comes from insulin. So this can give you this body shape right here. Okay? And then as far as the ovary body type, this usually comes from environmental estrogen, like the uh, chemicals in the GMO foods, uh, the pesticides, the insecticides, herbicides. It could come from birth control pills or something in the environment that mimics estrogen that then gives you this shape right here. And then we have the thyroid body type, which is weight gain all over, but this is usually secondary to high levels of estrogen, which can then lower the thyroid. Or you can have liver damage and then the thyroid can't convert T4 to T3. So it could come primarily from the liver and cause the thyroid issue. So really the question is, when did you start becoming this certain shape and have these certain symptoms? And what happened just before that event? And that's going to tell you like the more important thing that goes beyond the body types of the trigger so you can undo it. Was it a stressful situation? Was it a surgery? Was it a divorce? Whatever. Was it a sugar situation? In which case you're going to you know, fix the diet, get the basics in. Um, was it some chemical in the environment endo called endocrine disruptors that you need to start consuming a lot more cruciferous to clean that up? Or was it alcohol? In which case you have to stop drinking alcohol. Was it a certain medication? Let's say you're on steroids. There, I have certain videos on what to do if you've been on steroids, how to reverse that damage. Or was it coming from a virus? A virus can destroy the liver. It could also mess with the thyroid. So you really want to think beyond just the body types. Now, cortisol, estrogen, and insulin are the three fat-making hormones. They're dominating hormones. In the presence of any one of these, you're going to nullify and block all the fat-burning hormones. Okay? One of the fat-burning hormones would be T4 or T3. That's the thyroid hormone. Another big one would be human growth hormone. So if these are too high, these will be suppressed. So that's why the thyroid and the adrenal are usually secondary to these other ones. Does that make sense? Because these are dominating. Now out of these three, this one, insulin, is the most dominating. So in reality, this would probably be the most uh, common body type. 
but you can also look like this. You could look like this. You can even look like that because of the influence of insulin on these other glands. So in summary, just isolate when your problem started, okay, with your body shape and these other symptoms, and try to find out what triggered it. Was it stress? Was it diet? Was it something in the environment? Was it alcohol? Was there medication? Was there an infection? And that will give you the clue to reverse and undo your specific body type. Hey, if you enjoyed this video, press subscribe and I will definitely keep you updated.